the lady from Uncle. The lady. Hello, today I want to take a look at Google accounts and what they are. Before I go much further, I need to point out that there are actually different types of Google accounts. But the one I'm going to concentrate on just now is the consumer Google account. And that is one that is for free. You can create it with just about any kind of email address. And if you use Gmail for it, then it is a Gmail email using Google account. But it doesn't have to use Gmail. What is a Google account? A Google account is, if you like, the master controller. It is the, the dashboard. It is with which you own all of the Google products that you use at Google or on Google sites. So that could be something like Blogger. It could be YouTube. It could be um, Drive. It could be Photos. And of course, it can also be Gmail. So why do you need to have a Google account? Well, you don't really need a Google account until you want to use Google products in such a way that you have storage. So for example, think about it. If you want a YouTube channel and you want to upload videos to it, you need a Google account because you are storing videos that you've uploaded on a Google website and that requires you to identify yourself to YouTube and to Google. Similarly, if you want to use a Gmail email, then you need to have a Google account because Gmail is Google's email service and you need somewhere to store your emails. Same goes for Blogger and so on. Now, the really important thing with a Google account is to remember that because it is that it's the master account with which you own everything that is um, a Google product, you kind of need to consider security very seriously. That means that you have two step verification enabled. And I know it's not something that everybody wants to think about, but I cannot stress how important it is that you think of your Google account in much the same way you would anything that you attach any value to. So if you, for example, have very important emails inside your Gmail's inbox, or you have very important um, videos uploaded to YouTube, or for example, you have photos which you're storing in, in um, Google Photos, then you need to make sure that you secure your Google account. Because if you lose access to your master Google account, you lose access to everything. Now, I'm just going to quickly touch on the other kind of account that is at Google, and that is sort of the Google Workspace area. And that is a service that you pay for. So it's not free. You have a Google Workspace um, subscription and you can pay to, to host your domain, um, etc. on this. And then you have more sort of professional, should we say, access to some services at Google, some Google products, which are suitable for business. There is Google Workspace for Education, there's Google Enterprise, Nonprofit for Charity, etc. But the important thing to remember here is that Google accounts, whatever kind they are, are important and should be secured. Thank you for listening and goodbye.